Hi, Mr. Neal here. And for those of you that have been at FIS for a while, you've done a few of these ATL surveys and you're really comfortable with the approaches to learning. So this is just a quick reminder that the approaches to learning don't come from FIS, it comes from the IB. And it's a set of tools meant to help develop you into kind of the type of learner that the IB program is meant to develop. So when we think about the IB learner profile and that language of being caring people who are healthy risk takers and reflective on how we learn and how we treat others and curious, how do you become that kind of person? Well, you're on that journey. There's a lot of ways to do it. And the ATLs are one set of tools to do that. So as you fill out your survey today, we're really hoping that you do this for yourself and you do this really thoughtfully and thinking about how you've developed it, developed as a learner. Now, the last thing I would say, you know this already, but I will emphasize it again, is that if you decide today, I really need to target my self-management, that's what I want to work on. Well, you can't really work on self-management without working on other aspects of the approaches to learning. These things do overlap. If you're working on social skills, you have to probably do some things about the way that you treat others, your effective skills, the way you communicate. Likewise, when you get into research, you're going to have to do some critical thinking to be able to find bias within sources and some self-management to organize your notes in an interesting way. So we're not saying these things are all separate from one another. We just want you to find that aspect that you can really work on within the next few weeks that you will see instant and positive improvement in the way that you learn.